Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a reading for all the air signs watching. So if you are a Gemini, Libra or Aquarius, this reading is going to be helpful for you. And today we're going to be looking at the next major changes that you can expect in your life. So I just want to make it clear that this is going to be a timeless reading. So these changes can be applicable whenever you're watching this reading. Consider it a lovely little glimpse from the universe, from spirit to show you all the wonderful things that you can look forward to so super excited to see what comes up for you air signs um, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so that would be amazing um, you can become a channel member as well and if you were after a private reading please feel free to email me otherwise let's jump into this and see what's coming up for all the air signs watching what are the next major changes um, coming up in your life. Okay, let's pull out some more cards using the Rider Weight deck as well. This is really nice. Um, let's see the details of these next things. You've got enchantment, happiness, success, and innocence. Um, and this is powerful stuff here. You've got some dates that have come up as well. Um, looking, you know, at that enchantment, this is powerful stuff. Okay, so starting off with enchantment, this is really powerful because we have this new hobby or this new opportunity or a new distraction that's going to come up for you, air signs. Um, and I feel like there's going to be an opportunity for you to be inspired and this in turn is going to inspire you. So I feel like you're coming up to a phase where you're going to come across something in your life. It could be like on a YouTube video. You might be reading a book and then you get an idea. I feel like it is an idea. I do. I feel like it's through something of learning um, that you're going to get this idea. And I feel like it's destined for you because we've got the we've got the cards here. So I feel like there is a, a destined idea that's sort of going to come to you through spirit. Now, it could be a new business idea. It could be an idea for a book. It could be a new website you want to launch. It could be some sort of new spiritual path you want to pursue because the enchantment can be like spiritual as well. And I feel like it's something that's going to be very unique. It's a very unique idea or new opportunity that's going to come to your path here. We've got the seahorse, so it's almost like majestic. It's something that no one's done before, and you're going to be all over it, air signs. You're going to have this idea, and you, then you're going to take action to make it happen. I feel like you're going to collaborate with someone, though. Like, it's not going to be your own um, completely. Like, you're going to collaborate with someone who you know and trust, and it's going to yeah sort of both put you on the same path and it's going to make things happen even faster here for you so i mean that's a really really good sign because i think there's someone here who's going to want to help you um and it could be it could be a cancer or a libra uh, or it could be during the time of cancer or libra seasons here as well um so that's that's really wonderful you have happiness here as well so i feel like your happiness levels are about to change um i think for a lot of you you've come up as that two of swords so it's making you feel like a lot of you have given up on some things in your life or you think that something is no longer destined for you or you know you probably put a lot of hope or you know you you put a lot of your dependence of happiness into another person or into another thing and just because you haven't got it you've been stuck on this energy like it's not for me it's never going to happen you know you've been despaired about it but i'm here to tell you that there's a lot more happiness that's coming your way so you're either finding things that make you happy or you're finding happiness in the things that are already in your life i feel like it's a change of perception i do because i think there's a moment of enlightenment that's coming and that blindfold's going to be lifted so i feel like the way you see things is going to change and as a result your attitude is going to change so i see you very happy um and i feel like it may have something to do with the enchantment thing 
that may be one of the reasons why you are going to be more happy and you are going to feel more settled. So that's a really wonderful thing that could definitely be, I definitely do see a relationship um, and it can be with a Cancer or a Libra that's going to make you very happy. It can be a past relationship or I feel like it's a past life connection that's going to make you very happy here. So something that feels familiar to you is going to come back into your life and it's going to bring in a lot more happiness than you ever thought possible or it's going to bring in more happiness than you've ever had. So that's a good sign. I feel like there's something you can really work with here at Air Signs. So... And it could be like this past thing. I'm getting with the Six of Cups. There could be children happening here. There's a pregnancy. So there's a huge major life change in terms of a, a pregnancy that's coming or a new addition to the family. It could be through marriage. You might be getting married. You might be getting pregnant. But I see another person that's coming into your family. Um, and that's going to mean a lot. It's going to be really, really big. And I feel like you're going to be very happy about that. That enlarging the family that family expansion or bringing someone into your life that's going to end up feeling like family so that's beautiful um okay we also have the success card so huge amounts of success we've got march 18th to april 14th they may resonate we've got the eagle here so for some of you it's an independent success or it's a personal best is what i'm getting so i see you achieving something that's personal to you um, but it's on an independent level. So I think this is not anything to do with the collaboration I mentioned. I think this is something you're going to do for you. And it's something that's always been really important to you. It could be like losing a certain amount of weight or um, overcoming a certain phobia or fear or finally being secure, alone and independent without a relationship. It's something that is very personal to you and there's going to be success that comes out of it you're actually taking flight um i also feel like there's a message of success because you've got the bird you've got communication with success somehow so either communicating with people is the key to this success or once you overcome this you're going to share it with other people and that's going to be very inspiring for them to see so Yep, you can go out there, achieve your personal best, and then you'll write about it, you'll blog about it, you'll put it all over social media. You'll, not in a way that you're flaunting it, but you're going to be accomplished and you're going to be proud and you're going to be putting that out there to the universe and other people will want to know your story. I'm telling you, like, they want to know how you got to where you are, what you overcome, what you overcame, what you conquered, all those wonderful things. Um... She's wearing a green cloak, so I am seeing more money. Now, the Justice card can be like the scales of justice. So there could be um, success coming through like a contract. There could be success coming from a settlement, something that's legal, like an inheritance. There could be um, success linked to the law somehow. Okay, you might get a reward of some kind you might earn something here it's all legit though it's all legal it's all by the books and it's coming your way um air signs okay you also have the priestess of innocence now she's a very pure energy um and she does have this taurian like symbol so i don't want to say it's a sign I really feel like it's more a message here. Um, when I see innocence air signs, I feel like there is a very big experience that's coming your way and it's going to speak to your inner child. So in essence, there's a lesson here. Okay. There's a lesson here or it's something that's about to come into your life. That's going to bring out a very vulnerable part of you that is from your inner child. So it's, it's from a very deep and personal part of you. And it's either a person that's going to activate it, a thing, or an experience. I'm getting stars here, so I really feel like there will be an opportunity for you to heal some things that you have been hiding away from other people, that maybe you've had anxieties like with yourself, like maybe there's something that you have within you that's very personal to you, and you know you don't share it with a lot of people. Um, and, you know, you've, you've 
not forgiving yourself about this or you you know you're still angry at yourself about this it's really about overcoming this very personal vulnerable part of you and being kinder to your inner self i feel like there is a part of you that you haven't nurtured where you should have and you didn't because you were angry at yourself or you felt um you felt outcasted you felt different from other people like you didn't think anyone would understand because you were innocent as in a sense where it's still an experience for you to sort of grow and expand on that and you haven't done that as yet this experience is going to come to you very soon um and again we've got stars here so i do feel like there is healing it is a um a feminine energy so it could be around a feminine connection it could be around your higher feminine self it could be around a divine feminine it could be a, a relationship with like a mother or a sister or a female friend but female energy is nurturing and compassionate and caring so i feel like it's a huge lesson tied into compassion and care but it seems to be for yourself here air sign so this is a lot to do with self-love and you'll be so amazed once you sort of master that sort of self-love and you know work on that relationship with yourself and grow from that you'll be surprised as to how much all your other relationships in your life will change as well that's a really powerful reading for you air signs i think you've got a lot to look forward to here but i'm gonna leave it there so i do hope this reading has been helpful thank you again for watching and um i'm sure we'll catch up very soon so bye for now